Um, no, good. Uh, so, uh, Matt Ciso here in Washington, D.C., and welcome to my studio. Uh, we're here in the Adams Morgan neighborhood of Washington, D.C., and this is where I've painted in this studio, this wall, this area, and this floor, this table for uh, the last 14 years. Um, so there's 14 years of, of paint on this wall. Behind, behind this is an old easel that I use, but uh, it has 14 years of paint on that. and It's home for me, so it's nice, and I can paint all night if I want or all day. Uh, and it's very important to have all the paint all the time available to me because I don't like to clean. If you see my studio, it's a little messy today. Usually always messy, but uh, it's important for me to get out of bed and just start to work. And uh, this, uh, this, this gives me that, that freedom. Um, my day is always painting, so I find it exciting every day to uh, wake up and think what will I paint today or what will I finish today from the previous night or days um, and I always like to look forward to what's next with my paint. One of the things I, I think um, that uh, my process is a little different from most painters is that I in my my apartment now there's not a lot of paintings on the wall because thankfully they've been selling really well but uh, a lot of times if I have an older painting that that is on my wall and it hasn't sold I'll take it down and work on it or add more to it. So um, I feel if a painting hasn't sold within like a month, then it probably didn't have enough energy when I did it. So I like to put, put myself back into the painting and throw my, my energy into it. Because um, I think people, when they look at my work, they can tell whether a painting was, uh, was done with, with, with passion or just done because uh, maybe I felt like I had to paint. So it's more important for me to paint with passion than to just paint um, you know, a picture for a gallery or a, or a collector. I, I, like, I like to paint what interests me and that's, those are my best paintings. And luckily I've, I've been able to continue to, to, you know, show those and exhibit those around the world. <laughs>